Yesterday we flew from Hobart to Sydney and we just stayed at an airport hotel. The reason for that is because we are now back up again at 5.20 in order to get an early flight onto our next country. But first, a lounge. from the future here. We absolutely loved our time in the Centurion Lounge in Sydney Airport and obviously it's another lounge so therefore it's another rating. Starting out with food, it was all really good breakfast food. It was really nice to have a full English. They also had some pastries available as well as cereal. It was a small selection but not the smallest and the quality was really good so with that we're giving it an eight. They also had a great selection of drinks. They had a full soda fountain, water at your disposal, barista made coffee, as well as five different taps of beer and cider, a bunch of wines, and top shelf spirits. The only downside is that there was nothing portable that you could take with you. So, with that, then we're going to give this one an eight. Not much to say about the cleanliness, we're giving it a nine. Comfort wise, plethora of different seating options and very spacious. And certainly because of the fact that we went at quite a quiet time, then we had basically the freedom of the lounge. So therefore, we're giving this a nine. In terms of amenities, it had your typical Wi Fi, charging ports, as well as a shower. So we're giving it the same rating as every other lounge with those amenities an eight out of ten. And that gives this a grand total of 42 out of 50, which then, again, raises us among the top lounges that we have been to on our travels so far. saving measures these days, even with the mainline carriers, what kind of service and amenities you're going to get. But dang, Air New Zealand is class. They were so good. Like the in-flight entertainment was vast in terms of the options, the food was superb. And to top it all off, they even have free Wi-Fi on board. And this is considered that we're in the economy. I think that may have been quite possibly my best experience on an economy flight ever. Don't you think? Yeah, definitely. So good. We've settled ourselves here at Wellington Airport. We're probably going to grab a coffee and do some work, but there are no lounges here, so we're just going to hang out for our three-hour layover until we fly to our final destination in New Zealand today. Go. <laughs> Here we are. 
Hello. <laughs> How are you doing? Oh, take it off. So we were at the very far end that way. Oh. <laughs> We've been very bad vloggers because I've just been spending time catching up with my cousins on this, what, two hour drive from Auckland Airport to our Airbnb in Waitomo. But I figured I'd introduce you to everybody because we're gonna be spending five days together. So this is my cousin Ruth here. And in the front we have my cousin Jacqueline and Nick is doing an awesome job driving. So I think we're pretty close, 10 minutes away now. After an absolutely stunning drive, I think that's going to be the theme of the next few weeks. But anyway, after an absolutely stunning drive, we are here at our Airbnb and I think we're going to call it here. We will pick this up tomorrow. So until next time, take care. And keep smiling.